Hi there. So in this video, we're going to talk about rubrics and how to kind of copy a rubric or pull in a rubric from an existing course into another course. So kind of copying sort of or just kind of pulling in that already existing resource so you don't need to recreate a rubric. So I have here an open course and I'm going to scroll down to an assignment right here. I'm going to click it open. And right now there is no rubric associated with this assignment. So I'm going to click on the plus rubric button. And it's like, well, you can create one, but I don't want to because oh, that's a pain. Or I can click on find a rubric. So by clicking on find a rubric, it brings up all of the rubrics I have already created. And it lists them out by classes that I've created them for. So I might look for the class where that's going to match the rubric. So hopefully I remember like, oh, this is Excel calculating practice. Great. I'm going to just grab that rubric. And it's just going to pull it right into my existing course, right? So now this assignment has a rubric associated with it. So I'm just going to delete it just to show you again. I can plus rubric, find a rubric. And again, I could grab any rubric that I wanted um, that already exists in my own list of courses. So anything that's in there um, that I'm listed as an instructor, I can kind of pull into my, my assignments for my new course and add to an assignment. So I could be like, oh, I want to add this one. And I'm just going to click on this title. And now it's this rubric. Right? And also, you can, if you click on the little pencil, you can rename it if you need to. And then go down and decide things like, do you need to, are you going to use this for grading? Um, are you going to use the points? And like, I'm going to click update. And it's going to tell me my points are different. So I might say change. I don't know. So you're going to have to think about that as you're pulling in a rubric. Did you say that your points for this assignment are the same value for the rubric that you're adding to the assignment? So just think about those things. It's really handy it, like if you're using a discussion forum and the rubric's always the same, right? Like you're always saying like 10, maybe 10 points for what you post and five for responding to a student or whatever it is that you come up with, right? So you can just re-pull those in to an existing discussion forum as well. So that's how you pull in um, or copy a rubric from course to course.